Psalm 45. To the chief musician upon Shinshanam, for the sons of Korah, Mashal, a song of loves. My heart is indicting a good matter. I speak of the things which I have made touching the king. This is David speaking. My tongue is the pen of a ready writer. Thou art fairer than the children of men. Grace is poured into thy lips. Therefore God hath blessed thee forever. Gird thy sword upon thy thigh, O most mighty, with thy glory and thy majesty. And in thy majesty rule prosperously because of truth and meekness and righteousness. And thy right hand shall teach thee terrible things. Thy arrows are sharp in the heart of the king's enemies, whereby the people fall under thee. Thy throne, O God. David is now calling the king the son God. This is the question the Pharisees couldn't answer that, that Jesus asked. Why does the offspring of David, why does David call his own offspring God? Thy throne, O God, is forever and ever. The scepter of thy kingdom is a right scepter. Thou lovest righteousness and hateth wickedness. Therefore God, thy God, hath anointed thee with the oil of gladness above thy fellows. And thy garments smell of myrrh and aloe and cassia out of the ivory palaces whereby they have made thee glad. King's daughters were among thy honorable women. Upon thy right hand did stand the queen in gold of Ophir. Who's the babe? Who's the babe on the right hand of our son? Uh, the, the father's son. Who is this? King's daughters were among thy honorable women. Upon thy right hand did stand the queen in gold of Ophir. Hearken, O daughter-in-law. The father is now speaking. Hearken, O daughter, and consider, because the son is married. This is the queen. The the king is Yod Hey Vav at the right hand of Yod Hey Vav -Heh. The queen would be the father's daughter-in-law at marriage. Okay. Hearken, O daughter, and consider and incline thy ear. Forget also thine own people and thy father's house. If this is us, yes, we need to forget our father, our earthly father's false teachings, and the people. So if we do so, verse 11, So shall the king greatly desire thy beauty, for he is thy Lord, and worship thou him. And the daughter of Tyre shall be there with a gift. Even the rich among the people shall entreat thy favor, thy face. The king's, the, the king's daughter, in the, in the KJV, the king's daughter is all glorious with wind. The royal daughter, in the Hebrew, the royal daughter is all glorious within. Her clothing is wrought of gold. She shall be brought unto the king in raiment of needlework. The virgin, her companions that follow her, shall be brought unto thee. With gladness and rejoicing shall they be brought, the queen and her attendants. They shall enter into the king's palace. Instead of thy fathers, which we will forbear, because they taught us falsely, instead of thy fathers shall be thy, child, thy children, whom thou mayest make princes in all the earth. Instead of thy fathers being princes in all the earth, thy children of the queen and the king will be princes in all the earth. It will make thy, thy name, I will make thy name to be remembered in all generations. Therefore shall the people praise thee forever and ever. Who's the babe on the right hand of yod heh vav -Heh, at the right hand of yod heh vav -Heh? That's us. She's going to be adorned in raiment of many colors. Remember uh, Joseph and his technicolor dream coat? Um, he was a, a, of many different uh, representations. So shall this be. Uh, but we are, um, and, and we're the bride. So we need to clean up our act. Who's the babe? It's us. <laughs>